Thanks earlier to the uh, first uh, black female uh, mayor, Doris Davis. Uh, we are so proud and look forward to a continuation of that history making from our next inductee. So at this time, I am going to call again uh, uh, someone who uh, you just can't say enough in terms of how effective he is being as a legislator in whatever seat he's been sitting in. And he's the person who, when he says he's going to do something, he's going to do it. And along with he and Assemblyman Hall, uh, they have reopened the hospital that many said would never reopen. That's right. When he opened up his office, he said he believes in empowering the people, and he has kept that pledge uh, to the team. So I'm very happy and very proud to present to all of you, because you should all know him, so it's not an introduction, but present to all of you the individual who's going to swear in, A.J. Brown, and that's none other than the supervisor of the second district, Mark Ridley Thomas. Mark. Judge Fowler, ladies and gentlemen, I'm delighted to be here. My fellow elected officials, uh, we are here for a special occasion. We're here today to celebrate a new day in Compton. I said a new day in Compton. One that will be marked by hope, integrity, and opportunity. Repeat after me, hope, hope. Integrity. integrity, and opportunity. And opportunity. A, new a new day in count. When we can look forward to better jobs, better schools, safer neighborhoods, and a stronger civic culture. A new day in Compton, a new day when Compton will rise to meet uh, the promise as one of this region's truly great Cities. I believe Compton can do that uh, under the leadership and with the guidance of Mary elect Asia Brown. Yeah. All right. She is. We will come to know her as a person of great character, and compassion for the city that is matched only by her capacity to make that vision a reality. And the good news today, ladies and gentlemen, is that the city of Compton agreed with that very point, and that's why she was elected with an unquestionable mandate and a strong coalition to lead this city forward. Her expertise, dedication, and vision will be an asset not just for Compton, but the whole of Los Angeles County. And as chairman of the board of the Los Angeles County Board of Supervisors, I offer my full support and that of my colleagues. The strength of our county uh, relies in large part on the health of our individual cities, and we want Compton to be healthy. We count ourselves fortunate to have Asia Brown, uh, a regional partner uh, who is more than capable of making Compton the great city we know that it can be, and she can do that when all of us are pulling together to make Compton all that it can be. Asia Brown, uh, the people of the city of Compton have entrusted you with a great set of responsibilities. They trust you to realize the shared dreams of this city by leading in much the same way you've done throughout your career, by listening first, by building bridges across outdated divisions, by demanding accountability, by staying focused and doing what you set out to accomplish. The people of this city, the people of Compton, deserve no less. And all of us are here today uh, to support you at every step of the way. So we know that you are more than capable of not just meeting, but surpassing these expectations. And so it is in the spirit of trust, it is in the spirit of service, it is in the spirit of humility that I now invite you, Asia Brown, Mary Leck, to take uh, the oath of office to be the mayor of the city of Compton. Please welcome her as she comes. I want to ask, I want to ask. 
ask her pastor, the Reverend Rafer Owens, if he would uh, join us, and her mother, uh, the one and only Brenda Jackson, if she'd come forward, give her a round of applause as well. Support and defend the Constitution of the United States. That I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States. And the Constitution of the State of California. And the Constitution of the State of California. Against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Against all enemies, foreign and domestic. That I will bear true faith and allegiance. That I will bear true faith and allegiance. To the Constitution. 